So it's all about the power of cinnamon. Cinnamon is something that will change your life, like your spiritual life, the spiritual controls, physical. Use cinnamon is in your kitchen. Use it for your own advantage. Hello everyone, welcome to today's video, okay? Welcome back to my channel. So if you are new here for the first time, hello, 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 and thank you for joining me, okay? In this channel, I talk about spiritual tips, and also I talk about natural ways of taking care of yourself as a lady. But the spiritual tips I show here is for everyone, generally. So if you like any of these, if it sounds good, please subscribe, okay? Hit the red subscribe button. Turn on the bell so you get notified anytime I upload videos like this. Welcome, I really appreciate you. So today, we're going to be talking about the spiritual benefits of cinnamon, or rather, the power of cinnamon. Cinnamon is something that, that when you use, okay, in a spiritual way, it is it's going to touch every area of your life because it attracts good things. It has the power of attracting good energy to you and remove all those bad energies that stops you from progressing. So we're going to be talking about that and I'm going to be showing you how you can use it for best results. So let's just go ahead. So I've brought my own cinnamon and this is how it is. Okay, this is a stick of cinnamon and uh, there are many of them here as you can see okay so they also have it in a powdered form this powdered one is gotten from the stick if you have a very strong blender you can turn it you can turn the stick to a powdered form they actually have the same sense the scent is almost the same, but this is stronger because it's in a powdered form. So if you want, actually we're going to be using the powdered form. So you have to know how to turn this to a powdered form because that is how we're going to, this is how we're going to use it. So if you have this, just try to turn it into a powdered form. But if you want to get, it's best to get it in a powdered form. I use this to season my food at home and I use it in so many ways i use it for skincare like in my other channel my beauty channel i make i make use of cinnamon a lot and it's also very good for health as well okay if you want to get rid of unnecessary fats you have to combine this with some wonderful ingredients that will make it effective in getting rid of belly fat but today we are going to be using it for spiritual benefits okay to drive away bad energy to destroy wishes in fact, so many things. This is a spice that has spiritual benefit to mankind. It's something that will transform your life for good. It's something that when you apply it or use it, or you know, it can serve as a protective means. It can also serve as a way of drawing well to you. All these are made by God, okay? The ingredients I use on this channel, they are made by God and it's best to acquire wisdom. To acquire knowledge lack of wisdom can bring down a man this channel is not like it's just like emergency okay to get something you know when you can reach reach out to men of God like powerful men of God for solution you can use things around you to start with you can use things around you to overcome fear to get rid of bad energies around you. That is what this channel is talking about. Most people will just like, I don't blame them, it's just ignorance. You know, the Bible also acknowledges plants. Plants are made by God. We use it for healing. We use it, you know, for breakthrough. There are ways you use plants for your own benefit. And cinnamon is one of it. Okay? So, I don't want to emphasize on that. I just want to go straight and Cinnamon here, yeah, this is a powdered one, and this can attract wealth. It can destroy enemies. If you use it the right way, it can destroy your enemies. If you use it the right way, it can attract riches. It can, it can make it to blossom, you know, to, for your business to boom. 
contrast and so many more. The spiritual aspect of this is that it has the power of bringing good fortune to you. That is what cinnamon does. There are some natural ingredients that when you use it, it can actually bring bad fortune. Like God created the good and the bad. It's all made by God. So there are some good ones like this, made by God too. It's not as if those bad ones, you know, there are some wicked ones that uses those bad ones to perform evil work for people. And if you want to overcome or to stop those evil work done by people, okay, you have to check my channel for some tips. I have many videos that will help to destroy every causes, every evil thing the enemy is doing in your life. So this is for you if you experience hardship, if you experience difficulties generally, if you want your business to go forward, okay, if you want people to love you, if you want to get rid of hatred, because there are some people that people will just hate you unnecess unnecessarily, okay, that is because there are some things, forces covering you, making people, whenever they set eye on you, they will just dislike you. Or whenever people are going to a particular place and prospering, when you go there, you will find yourself that people will just hate you for no reason. So this has the power of bringing good luck and destroying the bad work the enemy has done or doing in your life. If you want to prosper in whatever thing you do, if you are going to be using this for business, you know, one thing, if you want to use it for wealth, to get wealth, you have to be sure that you have something doing. It's very important. Even if it's a little thing you are doing, even if you are working for someone, even if it's just a house help you are. You want people to love you. You want people to, you know, you want, you'll be happy when your salary is increased. It will give you joy. So you must have something you are doing. Get something doing. Even if it's just a little thing, it is going to help. So, if you are using it to attract wealth, to get wealth, to make people to love you, to favor you, you will have to get just a little of this. Just a little of this, you know. Pray towards it. Pray that this is what you want. You want this to help you, to bring prosperity, to make people to love you. You want your face to radiate. Like you want anytime people see your face, the person will want to favor you, you know, in one way or the other. So you have to add just little of it into your cream. The cream you apply. Okay, any cream of your choice. It can be Vaseline, it can be just any cream at all. Just mix it very well and pray that this is going to remove bad luck, remove hatred from you and make your face to shine and make people to love you and want to favor you okay so if you are using it for wealth if you have a business you have to add you know use drop little of it just some amount on the areas of your shop fork at the corners of your shop your business place just in four corners or on the doorstep just drop it and drop it like that and you have to pray before doing it and you will surely experience open doors. If you are going to be using it to get rid of causes, there are ways you should use it, okay? You have to pray and, you know, you can add it into your food. This is for eating, okay? It's a food. It's a spice. So, adding prayer into it, automatically it will turn to a spiritual thing. Prayer is not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. So, Adding prayer into it and you add it into your dish will make it so fast, work very fast. So apply it on your cream if you want to be favored, if you want, you know, your wishes, anything you want God to do for you. Just add it as you pray. God is going to do it for you. In the Bible, the Bible says there is a place that, and I'm going to write it on the screen, yeah, if I remember. It says, uh... Faith without work is dead. If you have faith in a particular thing without involving work, is dead. So you have to have faith in this that is going to work for you. And work towards it and you surely get your goals. You can't just, just sit down like this and be asking God, do this for me, do this for me, without working on that. You have to get something doing. You have to be hard working. And you have to use those things created by God to make your prayers to be so, so powerful. 
There are some people that they cannot do without burning candle when they pray. They must burn a candle before they pray. They believe that that is the fastest way for their prayers to be answered. When you believe on a particular thing, it will surely work for you. Burn candle. Some people burn candle. Why some people, they apply it on their cream and apply it. It works. It will just start working for them. Why some people, in just different areas, there are some people, they bring olive oil. They pray on it, on the olive oil. Olive oil is also from plants. They pray on it and they annoy themselves and say they need protection and they need, if they are going for interview, they will just pray and annoy themselves. It's just like this also. So you have to get cinnamon and say whatever you think you want to say for good. If you want to use cinnamon to go for evil mission or to, or to do evil work, it will not work for you because everything about cinnamon is for good. Everything about this, this wonderful spice that is smelling so nice, is scenting so amazingly. This is, this is a God's gift to mankind. So you have to use it the right way and see things working for you. So if you want protection, just drop it at the corners of your home. Okay, just, you know, some people decide to just drop like this. Just drop like few sticks in the, in the corners of their home. Some people prefer the powdered one. Me, I prefer the powdered one too. So just drop it, keep it at the corners or, you know, just a little. Or at the doorstep. This is going to destroy any evil thing coming your home. And automatically change it for good. Believe in it and it will work for you. And God will surely meet you according to what you need. Okay? So that is it for now. Please do subscribe to this channel in case you have not done so. Give this video a thumbs up and God will bless you and bless everything about you. Remain blessed until my next video.